Hey guys, welcome back to Celebrity Snap. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the 90s music stars, then and now. Let's get started. Anthony Kiedis Anthony was known for founding a rock band titled Red Hot Chili Peppers in 1983, when he was 21 years old. He was also the band's lead vocalist and helped it release albums such as Freaky Styly and Mother's Milk. Anthony is now 60 years old and still part of the band. Fred Durst Fred was famous for being the lyricist and frontman of the Limp Bizkit metal band. Besides being a band member, he also pursued acting in 2006 at 32 years old. Currently, Fred is 52 years old and was nominated for the Golden Raspberry Awards. Gwen Stefani Gwen gained fame for being one of the founders of the band No Doubt. She wrote all of the songs for this band, including Don't Speak and Just a Girl. Currently, Gwen is 53 years old and is a solo artist. Snoop Dogg Snoop Dogg became famous in 1992 when he appeared on Dr. Dre's single called Deep Cover. He's a songwriter and rapper that has sold millions of albums globally. Snoop Dogg is now 51 and has released a studio album called BODR. Axl Rose Axl has been part of the Guns N' Roses band since 1985. He also toured with another rock band called ACDC for a while. Axl is now 60 years old and helped the band release singles like Hard School and Absurd. Ricky Martin Ricky started singing at the age of 12 and was part of the band Menudo. He pursued a professional music career in 1991 at the age of 20 and then released albums like Mi Amaras and Ricky Martin. Ricky is now 51 and has been working closely with Enrique Iglesias. Justin Timberlake Justin is considered among the best-selling solo artists in the 90s since he sold more than 88 million records globally. He also received multiple awards, including the Emmy Award and the Brit Award over the years. Justin is now 41 and has been engaging in different films. John Bon Jovi John created the Bon Jovi Band in 1983 when he was 21 years old, and he was famous for being the frontman. John released more than 10 albums with this band, including Slippery When Wet, that got global recognition. John is now 60 years old and performed Here Comes the Sun at an inauguration event. Coolio Coolio was famous in the 90s for releasing hit albums such as My Soul and It Takes a Thief. He also released some singles that helped him win the Grammy Award, such as Gangsta's Paradise. Coolio is now 59 years old and has participated in a comedy puppet show. Madonna Madonna was called the Queen of Pop in the 90s. She released a couple of successful albums over the years, such as True Blue, Madonna, The Immaculate Collection, and Like a Virgin. Madonna is now 64 years old and was part of the Madame X Tour. Keith Flint Keith was known for being the frontman of the group Prodigy, which released popular singles such as Breathe and Firestarter. He also came up with his own band called Flint, but its first album got canceled before it was released. Unfortunately, Keith committed suicide in 2019 at the age of 49. Marilyn Manson Marilyn Manson was famous for being the lead singer and co-founder of the Marilyn Manson Band when he was 20 years old. He released hit albums such as Mechanical Animals and Antichrist Superstar in the 90s. He's now 54 years old and was nominated for the Grammy Award. Britney Spears This pop icon was recognized as one of the best-selling artists for selling about 150 million records across the globe. She's famous for albums such as Oops, I Did It Again and Baby One More Time. Britney is now 41 and has been named among the most influential people on the globe. Jay-Z Sean Corey, popularly known as Jay-Z, is a songwriter and rapper that began his music career in the 80s. He released his first album called Reasonable Doubt in 1996 when he was 27 and released 12 more albums over the years. Jay-Z is now 53 years old and has won the Grammy Award 23 times. Depeche Mode This electronic music band is made up of a trio. Depeche Mode is famous for albums such as Speak and Spell, Broken Fame, 
and Black Celebration. The group was nominated for the nomination into the Hall of Fame. James Hetfield James was famous for being one of the founders of Metallica and the lead vocalist in the heavy metal band. He's released 10 albums and won 9 Grammy Awards during his music career. Currently, James is 59 and is considered among the best guitarists of all time. Jonathan Davis Jonathan was well known for being the frontman and lead vocalist of a new metal band called Korn, which was founded in 1993. He's been experimenting with different musical styles over the years and released his first solo album called called What It Is at the age of 47. Jonathan is now 51 and has created a title track for a video game. Dolores O'Riordan Dolores was best known for being the lyricist and the lead vocalist of the band Cranberries, which released seven albums. She had a unique voice and helped in the release of albums such as No Need to Argue and Bury the Hatchet. Dolores died of accidental drowning in January 2018 at the age of 46. Bjork Bjork started gaining fame for being the lead singer in a rock band that was called The Sugar Cubes. She started her solo music career after the band broke up in 1992 and released albums like Debut, Homogenic, and Post. Currently, she's 57 and has been working on her 10th studio album. Enrique Iglesias Enrique is a Spanish-Filipino musician that started releasing albums and singles such as Experianza Religiosa and Si Tu Te Vas in the 90s. He started his recording career with a record label called Fonovisa Records, but later signed with the Universal Music Group label. Currently, Enrique is 47 years old and has been working on a single called Pendejo. Cristina Aguilera Cristina became famous in the 90s for releasing singles such as Come On Over Baby and What A Girl Wants. Most of her singles made it to the Billboard Hot 100, and she won the Grammy Award. Currently, Christina is 42 years old and has released a song titled Santo. Eminem Marshall Mathers, popularly known as Eminem, is considered among the greatest rappers in the world today. He released numerous albums over the years, including Infinite, The Slim Shady LP, The Eminem Show, and Encore. Currently, Eminem is 50 years old and is one of the best-selling artists today. Billy Joe Armstrong Billy was famous for being the lead guitarist and vocalist of the Green Day punk rock band when he was 15 years old. Besides being a band member, he also worked on other musical projects and collaborated with different solo artists. Billy's now 50 years old and is still part of Green Day. Gavin Rossdale Gavin was well known for being the lead singer in the rock band that was quite famous in the 90s called Bush. After the band disbanded, he joined another rock band called Institute, but later became a solo artist. Gavin is currently 57 years old and an Ivor Novello Award winner. Moby Popularly known as Moby, Richard Melville is famous for bringing dance music to the U.S. He got his breakthrough in his career after releasing a single called Go in 1991 at the age of 26. Moby is now 57 years old and has been working on an album called Reprise. Mariah Carey Mariah was called the Songbird Supreme in the 90s. She became a successful singer with the release of albums such as Daydream, Merry Christmas, and Music Box. Currently, Mariah is 53 years old and has inspired a ton of R&B artists today. Sonad O'Connor Sonad became famous after the release of the album called The Lion and the Cobra in 1987, when she was 21 years old. She also released a single in the 90s that was recognized by the Billboard Music Awards. Currently, Sanad is 56 and is retired from music. Gloria Estefan Gloria became famous in the 90s for releasing albums such as Into the Light and Mi Tierra, for which she won Grammy Awards. She was considered among the best-selling musicians of all time for selling over 75 million records worldwide. Currently, Gloria is 65 years old and has been acting in Father of the Bride. Celine Dion Celine released her first album, Unison, in 1990, when she was 22 years old. She started gaining worldwide fame after she continued releasing more albums, some titled Let's Talk About Love 
and Falling Into You. Celine is now 54 years old and is doing the Courage World Tour. Chris Isaac. Chris was famous for his hits such as Wicked Game, Somebody's Crying, and Baby Did a Bad Bad Thing. He's been an artist for over four decades and has released 12 studio albums. Currently, Chris is 66 years old and works closely with David Lynch. MC Hammer Stanley Kirk, popularly known as MC Hammer, is a songwriter and rapper who was quite successful in the 90s. He rose to fame for songs like Too Legit to Quit and You Can't Touch This. MC Hammer is currently 60 years old and manages his own recording business. Paula Abdul Paula became famous after releasing songs that made it to the Billboard Hot 100 charts, such as Cold Hearted, Forever Your Girl, and Straight Up. She won numerous awards during her music career, such as the Grammy and the Primetime Emmy Awards. She's now 60 years old and is a guest judge on American Idol. Enya Enya was referred to as the queen of the New Age music genre. She started her solo music career in 1982, when she was 21 years old and released her first album called Enya a few years later. Enya is now 61 years old and sings in different languages. Seal Henry Samuel, popularly known as Seal, was famous for hits such as Killer and Crazy, which he released in the 90s. He managed to sell more than 20 million records across the world. He's now 59 years old and has been participating in a film called Seal Team. Liam Gallagher Liam became famous in the 90s for being the lead singer of a rock band called Oasis. He left the band in 2009 to join BDI and started a solo music career in 2017 at the age of 45. Liam is now 50 years old and released a track called Everything's Electric. Jerry Cantrell Jerry gained popularity for founding the Alice in Chains rock band and being the lead guitarist. He became a solo performer in the late 90s and released albums such as Degradation Trip and Boggy Depot. Jerry's now 56 and has been working on his third album titled Brighton. Michael Jackson Michael had a music career for four decades and had greatly impacted numerous artists across different music genres. He was famous in the 90s for albums such as History, Past, Present, and Future, and Dangerous. He died of cardiac arrest in 2009 at the age of 50. Dixie Chicks The country music band was founded by Sisters in 1989, and it focuses on country and bluegrass music. It started becoming successful in 1998 after releasing hit songs like Wide Open Spaces and There's Your Trouble. Dixie Chicks are still in existence today, and the band has won 13 Grammy Awards. Tom York Tom was famous for being the songwriter and vocalist of a rock band titled Radiohead. He went solo in the 2000s and released his first album called The Eraser when he was 38 years old. Currently, Tom is 54 and is still part of a band titled The Smile. Trent Reznor Trent is known for being the songwriter and lead vocalist of a band called Nine Inch Nails, which was established in 1988. Besides being a band member, he also collaborated with different artists like Saul Williams and Marilyn Manson. Trent is now 57 and has won the Golden Globe Award. Lauren Hill Before starting her solo career as a rapper, Lauren was initially a member of the Fuji's hip-hop group. She released her first album called The Miseducation of Lauren Hill in 1998 when she was 23 years old. Lauren is now 47 and has won numerous awards, such as eight Grammy Awards. Maynard James Keenan Maynard was famous for being the lyricist in different rock bands, such as A Perfect Circle and Tool. He not only had a music career, but also started acting. Currently, Maynard is 58 and has been working with the Pusifer Band. Faith Hill Audrey Faith is among the most successful country music musicians. She became popular in the 90s for albums such as It Matters to Me and Tame Me As I Am which made it to the Billboard country charts. Currently, she's 55 years old and was inducted into the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Sean Puffy Combs Sean founded his record label in 1993 when he was 24 years old 
He's a record producer that's been working with different artists, such as Usher and Mary J. Blige. Currently, Sean is 53 and has helped Burna Boy produce an album called Twice as Tall. Vanilla Ice Robert Matthew, popularly known as Vanilla Ice, released his first album called Hooked when he was 22 years old. He became famous in the 90s for hits such as Play That Funky Music and Ice Ice Baby. Currently, the rapper is 55 years old and also does acting besides music. Mary J. Blige Mary was called the queen of hip-hop soul in the 90s due to hits such as Be Without You, Real Love, and Not Gone Cry. She's won awards, including the American Music Awards and the Grammy Awards. Mary is now 51 years old and recently performed at the 2022 Super Bowl show. Eddie Vedder Eddie is well known for being a guitarist and lead vocalist in the rock band called Pearl Jam. His powerful baritone vocals enabled him to be ranked among the best lead singers of all time. Currently, Eddie is 58 years old and has released his third album called Earthling. Natalie Imbruglia Natalie started her singing career in 1993 when she was 18 years old and released a song called Torn. She later released an album called Left of the Middle and won a couple of awards, including the ARIA Awards. Natalie is now 47 years old and has been working on a single called Build It Better. Damon Albarn Damon was famous for being the lyricist and lead vocalist of a rock band called Blur in the 90s. Some of the albums that he helped the band release include Park Life, The Great Escape, and Modern Life is Rubbish. Damon is now 54 years old and a solo artist. Erica Badu Erica was referred to as the queen of neo-soul in the 90s for focusing on this subgenre. She released her first album in 1997 when she was 26 years old, and it was certified triple platinum by the RIAA. Erica is now 51 and also does acting. Michael Bolton Michael was famous in the 90s after releasing an album called Time, Love, and Tenderness. During his music career, he also collaborated with different artists, including Celine Dion, Percy Sledge, and Winona Judd. He's currently 69 years old and is still in the music industry. Tom Morello Tom was famous for being the rock band Rage Against the Machine, founded in 1991. He later joined Audio Slave and toured with the E Street Band. Tom is now 58 and has been working on the Atlas Underground Flood album. Brandy Brandy gained fame in the 90s for releasing a single called The Boy Is Mine. She also released an album called Never Say Never, which enabled her to win the Grammy Award. Currently, Brandy is 43 years old and she's been working on a single called Nasty Girl. Vanessa Williams Vanessa started her music career by releasing an album called The Right Stuff in 1998 when she was 25 years old. She continued releasing more albums in the 90s such as The Sweetest Days and The Comfort Zone and received Grammy Award nominations. Vanessa is now 59 and also does acting. Shania Twain Shania was referred to as the queen of country pop in the 90s. She released different albums during that time, including The Woman in Me and Come On Over. Shania is now 57 years old and has been narrating a documentary film. Alanis Morissette Alanis started her music career in the 90s and released two dance pop albums. Her most successful album was Jagged Little Pill, which she released in 1995, and sold over 22 million copies worldwide. Alanis is now 48 years old and has been participating in an adult animation show. Cheryl Crow Cheryl was a star in the 90s for releasing songs such as Strong Enough, All I Want to Do, and Tomorrow Never Dies. During her music career, she's managed to sell over 50 million albums across the globe. Cheryl is now 60 years old and is a Grammy Award winner. Tony Braxton Tony released her first solo album in 1993 and made it to the Billboard 200 charts. She was popular for such songs as Breathe Again, Unbreak My Heart, and You're Making Me High. Tony is now 55 years old and has been participating in a film called Lifetime. Spice Girls This was a famous girl group that released an album called Spice, which became among the best-selling albums by a girl group in history. They also released another album called Spice World in 1997 and sold over 14 million copies across the world. 
The group did not last for so long since they disbanded in 2000, and each member started focusing on a solo career. Jennifer Lopez J-Lo began her music career in the 90s and released albums such as On The Six and J To The L-O The Remixes. This pop culture icon is famous for singles such as All I Have, I'm Real, and If You Had My Love. Lopez is now 53 years old and also stars in different films and TV. Billy Ray Cyrus Billy was famous in the 90s for releasing a hit single called Achy Breaky Heart, which became the best-selling single in 1992. Bill has managed to release 53 singles and 16 studio albums during his music career. He's now 61 and is also in acting. Trisha Yearwood Trisha gained fame in 1991 when she released her first single called She's In Love With A Boy when she was 27 years old. She continued to release more hits over the years, including Believe Me Baby I Lied and The Song Remembers When. Trisha is now 58 years old and has been working on every girl's album. Brooks and Dunn This was a country music duo that was made up of members who were both songwriters and vocalists. The duo was famous for songs such as My Maria and Ain't Nothing About You. The duo retired in 2009 and performed their last concert in 2010. Garth Brooks Garth was famous for albums such as No Fences, The Chase, The Hits, and Rope in the Wind. He managed to win different awards during his music career, including the RIAA Award, American Music Awards, and Grammy Awards. Currently, Garth is 60 years old and had a chance to perform on the inauguration event of Joe Biden. Thanks for watching.